Hey viewers, welcome back to the channel. Uh, another Warhammer video for you today. I wanted to show you the Inceptors that I painted. So I ended up painting two squads, two squads of three, uh, for an upcoming tournament. I say upcoming. It happened months ago, but I'm lazy and getting videos up. So at the time, it was an upcoming tournament, which means I did them quick. Uh, so the paint may not be up to the best quality. But I wanted to show you what I did and mainly show you the magnetization options that I did. So... Um, I ended up running one squad with bolters, one squad with plasma, just to have the variety. And uh, so here is one. And I decided to paint one up, deviating from uh, the second company gold, and paint them up in fourth company uh, ultramarines. Since I was running Ventress in my list, I figured it kind of made sense to have some fourth company stuff in there. So pretty easy to paint, you know. Uh, not, uh, not a whole lot of fanciness or anything. Um, but we can talk about magnetization, and really, it's just the arms, right? You get enough to where big four millimeter, four by two uh, millimeter magnets, you know, there and then in the shoulder is what you want to do, and they hold pretty good, right? So you can have plasma or bolters. Um, what you'll find is that they do not have, uh, you don't have enough shoulder pads. So what I did to make this work mostly is you can see I had. I had a set of three of the Gravis uh, upgrade uh, shoulder pads from the Ultramarine upgrade sprue, right? That has the molded pad in there. And so I used those uh, for some, and that allowed me to have extras to where I could magnetize and at least have like, um, so this, this second company squad has shoulder pads for their full options. So I can run them as plasma and they have shoulder pads. And then this squad for their bolters, I don't have all the shoulder pads for them. They're just bare, so. But eventually, if I get shoulder pads, I can I can fix them up, right? Not a big deal. Just get some extra bits. But that is how they turned out, and I think they turned out all right. Um, again, I tried to I tried to mimic the box art, so we did the little checkered on his knees, right? Decal and and whatnot. So not much to them. Uh, they're a fun unit to play. Um, I gotta learn how to play them better, but they're a fun unit to play certainly. Um, they're not as much now since they went up in points. That is about all I had to show you. Uh, Inceptors, fun unit, easy to magnetize. So if you're looking to magnetize yours, I hope that uh, this helps you. Again, the general rule: always go with the bigger magnet than you can, than 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 you, you know the biggest magnet you can. I should say. In this case, those are four by two millimeter. So thank you all for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.